50 million years ago, during the late Thoracic period, floppy disks roamed the Earth. Tragically, dinosaurs didn't have thumbs and couldn't put them into their computers. Because of this, Microsoft is releasing the Windows 8 App Store. Join me, Ford Pearson, as we take a look at the newest evolution in applications. An app's life begins when you open the Microsoft App Store and search through it to find an app that you want to download and install. In this case, we're going to be installing the Popular Science app. You click on the app's icon, and then from there, click on the Install button, and it's automatically downloaded and installed on your computer. When the install is complete, you'll be notified via a pop-up window. When you go back to the Start screen, you'll see your app's icon along with all the other tiles. To open your app, you click on its tile and then wait while the app loads. All Windows 8 apps use a horizontal scrolling orientation so that when you scroll your mouse wheel down, you scroll to the right, and when you scroll it up, you scroll to the left. To configure a Windows 8 app, you go to the charm bar and to the settings charm. From there, you'll see various options depending on which app you're running. In this case, we can change the language to Spanish. And now I can't read this. You'll notice on your Windows 8 desktop, some tiles have animations that they scroll through, which give you more information about what that app is doing. These are called live tiles. For example, you can see what search terms are trending on Bing. When you have an app open, you can switch between it and other running apps by moving your mouse to the upper left-hand corner and then dragging down. There you'll see a list of every app you've opened recently. You can also multitask between Windows 8 apps by clicking the top of the window and moving it to either side of the screen. Then when you open another app, it will be opened in full screen on the remaining area of the screen. To close an app, you drag from the top of the screen to the bottom of the screen. When you've decided that you've had all the popular science you need, you can uninstall the app by right-clicking on it and clicking uninstall at the bottom of the screen. It'll ask you to confirm, so click uninstall, and the app is gone. So that was the Windows 8 App Store. Join me next time as we disassemble a 1972 Ford Pinto.